This video is going to cover how to change the name of your site and how to unenroll teachers from your site that you may have shared the course with last year. This is uh, two common questions I get at the beginning of the school year. So in Moodle, you're going to come over here to Administration. It may be on your right or your left, depending on where you've docked it. And first, I'm going to go to Edit Settings. The settings for your course tell you the course name and the short name. So if I wanted to change this from SE Sandbox to SE and Jones Sandbox, because maybe now I'm team teaching with that person, I can retype that here, and then maybe I'm just going to call this uh, Wakeland Sandbox, or maybe I make a match. It doesn't really matter. It's entirely up to you. This is where your course is located. If you switch schools, maybe you want to use this drop down menu and put it at its new location. Uh, when you're all done, go ahead and click Save Changes. And anybody who is the editor of their course can do those minor changes. So now you'll see up here at the top, it says Wakeland Sandbox. And if I go back to the main menu where all the courses are listed, when you kind of navigate in, I would see that the, the class name has changed. I can also see that up here at the top. The second question I get asked a lot as teachers are going in and out of schools or um, switching preps is how do I remove or add a teacher as a user? So again, I'm going to go over to administration. I'm going to go to the users and hit the little triangle to open it up. And then I'm going to go to enrolled users. This is going to show you everyone that is enrolled in your course. And in my course, I'm the only one enrolled in it. But let's say I wanted to add someone or take someone away. If I want to take them away, I can simply um, come in here and remove their rights, or I can come over here and I can X out of the enrollment method and completely get rid of that person. So first I'm going to enroll someone. First you need to come up to the top and decide what level of editing you're going to give them. Because I'm in the Staff Learning Hub, you'll see the names are a little bit different. In yours, uh, if you're a teacher, it will say Teacher. So I'm just going to come in here to Course Facilitator, and I'm going to pick uh, one of the other facilitators and search for her name and enroll her. And finish enrolling. And you will see that she now appears. If I want to remove her from this, I would simply come over here to the X, which as you mouse over should say unenroll. And it will ask, do you really want to do this? And I say yes. And you will see that that person is now gone. So. Those are just some beginning of the year tips to help you with your Moodle.